move over chat GBT. There is a new AI tool making huge waves. Deep Seek has burst onto the scene. It is one of the most downloaded apps in the world right now, and it is also causing U.S. markets to plummet. Let us bring in uh, business analyst Chris McCusker. And Chris, I'd never <laughs> heard of this before. <laughs> Where does this app come from, and why such concern on stock markets? Okay, so basically it's been around since 2023, but it got really popular the last couple of days, Alan, because it has an app that does act like ChatGPT, and the app got incredibly popular over the weekend, surging to the top of some charts after we learned that it produces a chatbot that competes with the latest technology. So yes, with ChatGPT, but this part is key. It's done for a fraction of the cost. So as a comparison, DeepSeek says it took two months and it cost under $6 million. Analysts estimate that big U.S. cloud companies will spend $250 billion this year on AI infrastructure. So some even questioning, Alan, whether or not this is legit. This is a true story. I guess time will tell, but for now, it's a thing. So maybe the AI is not artificial, it's real intelligence? I've, I, have <laughs> I have many, many questions, but China obviously is pushing deeper into AI. Yeah. That's yeah. clearly rattling the market. Uh, it really is, and it's actually kind of putting into question uh, the U.S.'s dominance around artificial intelligence. So the NASDAQ wiped out all of its gains so far this year just today. It was down by more than 600 points. The S&P saw its worst day in about a month. And then shares in NVIDIA took a huge hit, slipping below $3 trillion in market cap. NVIDIA now actually into the history books with the biggest one-day drop in market cap in history, almost $600 billion. It actually wiped out its previous record set by NVIDIA last September. NVIDIA, of course, has been the biggest beneficiary of AI spending because they design semiconductors used in the technology. So more to come on this, I'm thinking. It's only a matter of time before Skynet <laughs> is sentient. Thank you, Chris. Appreciate that. That <laughs> okay. is Chris McCusker.